We wrapped up the meeting about three o'clock and then started heading back to Bella on a different route than we came, one that was across the valley. And it was actually called Low Trail. We always make a habit of never taking the same route. We started on that trail about three o'clock and about 3.30 is when the first shots rang out. That was the initiation of their ambush. One shot, you know, down into the valley and then it was two shots and then it was just full automatic fire in RPGs. It was coming in multiple directions. One was directly across the valley from where we were. If I was facing forward on the trail, it would be like directly towards my left. It came from straight in front of us, and then they were also on a ridge just to the upper right of us as well. First thing is to return fire. I mean, you're trained to suppress the enemy, get them on their heels, make sure that they can't pin us down, try to get to cover and call for support. It was really hard to see the enemy because the sun was setting where the enemy was located, so it blacked out that side of the mountain, but the sun was still on ours, so the sun was directly on our eyes. And, and they also picked a spot on the trail where it was basically no cover. It was a, a cliff going up and a, and a cliff going down with just this little cut in the side of it where we were. And we knew already we had to get through that area quickly because as we were moving into the ambush zone, it came across the radio, hey, you know, let's, let's get through this area quick. You know, we didn't get through it quick enough. They had uh, rocket-propelled grenades, or RPGs as they're called, AK-47s. I was receiving some pretty effective fires, so I don't know if they were good marksmen or they had some sort of more of a long-range weapon, like a sniper rifle or something.